Scotty from Alderley Edge. Hello, Scotty. How are you, mate? Uh, long time listener, first time caller, mate. Very nice to hear from you. Very nice to hear from you. Um, about the Prince Dinky of Dinky Diana. Dinky-do! Yeah, Dinky-do. About the, um... Dinky-do! Dinky-do, Scotty! Dinky-do, lads! Dinky-do! Yeah, sorry about that. You've got some fans here. Yeah, that's your grown-up family. Yeah, my grown-up family. No, we're in work at the minute. Right. Um, Get on with your work, you lot! Yeah, fat chance. Um, no, about the Princess Diana thing. Yes. Um, yeah, I, I agree with you, uh, somewhat, but um, I also think to myself, well, you know, the, the, the woman's a, a human being. She died, and she should be laid to rest and left alone. Yeah, but a lot of people want to remember her, you see. I agree with you. I think she should be laid to rest and left alone, you know. Well, to remember her, that's fine. You remember but a lot of people her. want to remember her, and this would be a good way, because, I mean, she was an attractive woman. No. Very presentable. Yeah, no, I, I agree with that. She and she looks good on this on this uh, image of, of the Virgin Mary. Uh, to, personally, uh, I haven't seen it. Um, she was a good-looking woman. Yeah. Um, and we don't know what the Virgin know. Mary actually looked like anyway. Well, no, we don't, but she did an awful lot for the for the country, and she... she what, the Virgin Mary or Diana? No, Diana, she Diana. did an awful lot for, um, the, uh, for, for the, for the, uh, princess, and, uh, sorry, the prince, sorry. But the thing is that, um... Take your time. Yeah, I'm getting a bit flustered. Are you all right? Time caller. Oh. Is, um, is your bottle going? Yeah, totally. Oh, are you okay? Yeah, I'm alright. Oh. No, she did a lot for the uh, the royalty, basically, of of this country, and I feel that uh, she's been shortchanged somewhat. I, I know that uh, she had a lot of pressure on her, but I, I don't think they should put this pressure on her, to be perfectly honest. Alright, mate. I feel that uh, that you should just leave her alone. She She is dead, and for whatever reasons she's dead, I don't know what reasons, I'm a total believer in Princess Diana, and uh, why? Well, just, just why do it? For, uh, only for publicity, as far as I can see. You know, if, if you're not good enough, then you're not good enough. Right. Uh, All right then, mate. Do you do you feel that that's it or what? That's it or do what? Do, yeah. No. Do you think it's for publicity or do you think? That's well, no. I mean, I think it's. Uh, I mean, it looks the parts. It's. It's. It's controversial it is a statue depicting princess diana as the virgin mary and it's obviously somebody's creative idea and i think will it catch on do you believe in god do i believe in god do you believe in god what why do you ask well if you believe in god then you obviously believe in uh, the virgin mary right do you believe in god well, if I do, yeah, I mean, what difference would that I know, make? I know that this subject's to be missed, but if you believe in God, then obviously you're Christian. Yes. And you believe in the Virgin Mary. If you believe in the Virgin Mary, surely you have your own vision of what the Virgin Mary is. Well, it's, only from the Renaissance paintings. Uh, the Renaissance paintings? Yes. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I, I have a picture of the Virgin Mary. And, and what does she look like? Well, to be perfectly honest, it isn't... Princess Diana. It never has been Princess Diana. I, I, I Not, is she more dark haired? Your vision? In in my vision, well, my vision is my vision. It it isn't anybody else's vision. No, no. But what what is it? Could you describe your vision? My vision is a petite woman with short dark hair. I'll just make a note. And petite, short dark hair. Yeah. Right. Well. Well, that's it, basically. I'm that's certainly, I don't think Diana fulfills that, really, does she? Well, no, she doesn't, but like I said... Now, where did you get your Where did you get your image from, may I ask? Well, um, well, it certainly wasn't from church. It was the fact that... Did you just make that image up in your mind's eye? That was my image of the Virgin Mary. It wasn't, um, it, it wasn't anybody else's vision. It was just what I felt. So you, you're a one-off, then? Well, how do you see her? Do you see her as a voluptuous blonde? Um, I really have no uh, ideas one way or the other. As I say, you know, my image is very much the image we were brought up with. Well, surely, no, no offence, but the image that you were brought up with was what? Well, the image I was brought up with was the same as you, the statues in school or 
or uh, in church or chapel, the Renaissance paintings from the great religions. <sighs> but then there's also one of God, you see, and he's painted as fairly elderly with a big beard. Well, I don't... Then there's Christ. I, I don't see God. There's I... Christ who's sort of, um, you know, how could I say, Jewish-looking. With a beard. With a long, beard. Scraggly hair. Long hair, yeah. And... Uh, and, and, a, and a robe. And this is no no offence to Christianity, but on, on a, a a cross, because that's how. If I close my eyes, that's how I see Jesus. Well, I'm thinking of pictures when before he was crucified. You know. Well, that that's fine. That's just. I mean, I just closed my eyes, and that's how I saw Jesus. It's coming up to. It's coming to Christmas. That's how I saw Jesus. But I don't think cross. you see Jesus on a cross at Christmas. Well, whether you get it from. I mean, Jesus was just born at Christmas, so yes, he wasn't know, crucified know, for 33 years after. Yeah, but what you've got to remember is that if you, uh, most of the films that are on around Christmas are, are depicting Christ. Obviously. But we're celebrating Christ's birth, not his crucifixion. Yes, but what you've got to remember is that you're brought up with these films, and at the end of the film, the most horrific view is of Christ on the cross. Yes, but not and, at Christmas. And that, you see, no. You see Jesus in a manger, that's fine. Yes. But as I see it... And you see his mother with him. Yes, you do, but uh, that, that's how Hollywood portrays it, so perhaps we, we all view it in a sort of a... Well, isn't it, wouldn't it be better for the Madonna to have Princess Diana's image rather than Hollywood's? Uh, you tell me. I mean, uh, personally, I'm quite happy with the image that I have. Of, you're, um, you're quite of happy with Hollywood? Mary. No, the, well, yeah, I mean, basically, yes. I mean, they turn around and they thought, right... Uh, um, but isn't it quite go Virgin a good Mary. idea if we have the Virgin Mary portrayed as a British woman? Oh, uh, British? Uh, who was the... She wasn't British. Was she not? Well, I mean, uh, why should she? If, she? if she was in, you know, if she was in, like, Jerusalem, why... But why the British were in Jerusalem for years, weren't they? Were they around there at that time, at 2,000 years ago? Don't know, uh, actually. I'm not sure no, of the travel arrangements. No, and neither am I. But I doubt it very much. I right. Mean, it's, it's not one of those... Uh, you uh, might know more about it than me. Exactly. Uh, I Did you say I know more, or... No, I'm saying you might know more than me. I know no more than you, and, and no more than anybody else. I mean, the Bible was supposed to have been written 75 years after Christ's death. Surely right. Christ, that would make it fable, and... I, I, I'm not... I'm not a, a disbeliever, but I, I'm not a, a, a believer as such. I'm. You turn around to me and say, "What do you see, the Virgin?" Mary? Are you are you uh, uh, an agnostic, or are you not sure? Uh, well, you tell me. Uh, I would like to say that I'm not sure. Or I think you're not think. sure. So I'm I think agnostic. I think I'm not, you're not sure if you're an agnostic. One or the either. Yes. Are you an atheist? Very much the same. No, I'm not an atheist. Not an atheist. I'm so. not an atheist. I don't uh, believe that there isn't. Right. Um, I would like to believe that. Uh, I would like to believe that until I am proved. Correct. Uh, Sorry. The, 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 there is. Then. Uh, and what sort of what either. sort of proof are you looking for? Because perhaps yes, here is me. here is Princess Diana who has died, and may well be resurrected in the image of the Virgin Mary. Uh, yeah, I, I understand your point. You, you're talking about reincarnation. Uh, after the fashion, yes. So you're talking about reincarnation. Well, I'm please. talking more about resurrection. Uh, so you're saying that the Virgin Mary was uh, resurrected as Princess Diana then, yeah? Well, do you not see the Virgin Mary round you every day and daily? I don't. Ah, right. Uh, personally, I don't, because, uh, as I said to you before, I am neither one thing nor the other. I'm not a believer, I'm not a disbeliever. Right. I, I get on with my daily job. But you've got I, your I've own... I've been at work since 8 o'clock this morning. Ah, listen, you Why must not? be shattered. I'm going to let you go. Well, you... I mean, you're talking about Christianity when yeah. you say, That's I'm not around you all the time. Well, the most Christian thing I can do is let you go, because you must be shattered. Absolutely. Scotty McClue's Late Night Phone-In. Have you phoned yet? Think you do. 